it's crazy. gonna be so cold. Yeah. So you remember we were just out here three months ago because they're like really ramping up construction of the new Samuel Air and Space, Samuel Ocean Air and Space Center, a $400 million new home for the Space Shuttle Endeavor. That three months ago, they put in the foundations and now they're actually bringing in these twin rocket motors. They're huge, like really big, 115 feet long. They're gonna be making its move starting today from the Mojave Desert. I wanna show you video of what this is gonna look like. They wanna put, you know, the Space Shuttle Endeavor in the vertical position. They call it the ready to launch position. This is gonna be 20 stories high. It will be incredible and that will be done over the next uh, couple of years. But first they gotta bring all the parts of this stack together. And that includes those two rocket motors, 160 miles from their current home at the Mojave Air and Spaceport right here to the California Science Center. So it, it does a two uh, day journey and it's only gonna be going like 45 miles per hour through freeways and then the streets of Los Angeles. Uh, and uh, it starts at nine o'clock this morning there on Mojave. Here's some of the freeways. If you're in and around the area, you might see them traveling down the freeway along with the CHP Escort, the 395 down the 15 through the Cone Pass down the 210 freeway to Irwindale, south on the 605 freeway. It stops around noon today in the Irwindale area, takes a 15 hour break, and then starting tomorrow at 3 a.m., the journey resumes, taking it down to 605 to the 105 to the 110. And then around five o'clock tomorrow morning, it hits the surface streets here in Exposition Park. So if you want to head out and see this, again, this thing is uh, these twin rockets are huge 116 feet in length the public is invited to gather along figueroa street from west 43rd place to 39th street and then it takes its last two miles to the california science center and they're they're telling us that it's going to stop around 7 30 in the morning in that location so you can take a look and then you can kind of follow it and walk it all the way here to the california science center they're opening it a little earlier tomorrow so if anybody wants to see that and also to see the spatial endeavor you can do so. By the way, I should tell you that uh, the spatial en endeavor will be in that horizontal position only until the end of this year, and then it takes a little bit of a hiatus because they have to move it into the vertical position behind me right there, and that could take a couple of years or so. So uh, come out and see it before the end of December, and if you want to come out and see this tomorrow, then be in place uh, by 7 o'clock, even earlier than that. They're asking people to take public transportation because they are expecting a lot of people to come out here and check it out. Love it. Historic. So cool. Yeah, you want to check that out. 20 stories high. I know. Something to see. Yeah. Thank you, sir. We appreciate you. Yeah. All right. Let's switch gears. Let's get another check of traffic.